Hey what's up guys, my name is Hunter and for today's video I'm going to be sharing a new model that I got with you guys. Now obviously if you looked at the title you know it's my first glossy model. So not only did I want to make this video because A it's my first glossy, but B because this isn't really a model that I, or that you would normally see that would be someone's first glossy. Not like he's anything uber rare or uber special or like really hard to find or anything like that. I just find that for me it's definitely not a glossy model that I expected to be my first one. Plus, he's also for one of my congas, so it works out even better anyways. So, yeah. <laughs> the glossy model that I have gotten is going for gold on the Lonesome Glory mold. Now, I saw him for sale on a Briar Sales Facebook group or page, one of the two, for 65 And I asked the person the cheapest that she could do with shipping to Canada, and she said 70 so I mean, that was pretty good. When I was talking to her about the model and stuff, she was so nice about it, really, really nice. And she showed pictures that he had a few little rubs on his ears here, and he had a couple little nicks in his gloss, but they're so barely noticeable that I didn't really care. He's such a nice model, and I'm really glad I could add him to my collection, because now I can add him to my Lonesome Glory Congo, which I'm hopefully going to be expanding more soon. And then he's also my first glossy model, which is really exciting, because obviously I've never had a glossy model before. Now, actually having a glossy model for the the first time I actually quite do particularly like them but my opinion from my previous glossy video still stands. But yeah the funny thing was about him is that the shipping actually cost like 24 something but the seller didn't know that so when she gave me the tracking number she's like I guess shipping for Canada went up since the last time I shipped there I'll, I'll know next time to ask for shipping because she didn't know how much it cost, so I actually kind of got away with not actually spending all that extra money on shipping, which I also find is a score for me. But the thing that did suck is that I ended up having to pay like an extra $14 at the post office, so technically he did cost me like $84, but still got him for under 100 and I'm really happy with my purchase because I really, really like this horse, and he's so pretty. The gloss just makes his color stand out so nicely, and I love the little stripes he has, and his dorsal stripe on his back is really nice, and it's just overall really, really like the horse and I'm actually really glad that he was my first glossy model because I know a lot of people are telling me to get the glossy GG Valentine and Heartbreaker models especially because they're quite easy to get a hold of but I kind of wanted something new and different and sort of I guess special to be my first glossy model so I'm glad I was able to get him so yeah that is my short little video guys I hope you enjoyed I kind of just wanted to make a video on this model because like I said obviously he's my first glossy model so I thought that'd be something interesting to make a video on. Let me know down in the comments which was your first glossy model or if you don't have a glossy model which glossy model you're hoping to get or anything like that I'd love to know. Give this video a big thumbs up if you enjoyed. Subscribe to my channel for model horse content as I post as often as I can and I'll see you all in the next video. Peace. As soon as I start the video, you guys both need attention now. This isn't this isn't going to work.